Hi, this is the final part eight of how to draw a map in Adobe Illustrator CS4. Uh, I'm Carl Goode, and um, what I'm going to do now is just clip off the edges of this map. Um, you can see that it's a little sloppy on the edges. My guide is 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 uh, is inside the the uh, the polygons I've drawn, and I want to I want to trim it to that guide. Um, one of the problems with doing that is by doing so, I'm going to cause the layers to get all flattened into the mask layer. I've created a layer above them at the very top called mask. And you want that to be on top. And um, you also want to probably go do a file save as of this document so that of this file this file so that you can go back and use the work on the layered version for other maps you want to work. But if this is the final map and you're going to go to press, you just have to um, mask this off. I'm going to click on this box and draw a box right over the top of my guide, just clicking and dragging it down. And you know, it's it's the last color I use, but it can, it doesn't matter. It can be any color. Uh, it doesn't really matter uh, because we're going to uh, it's going to disappear. So what I do now is I select the whole thing. I'm dragging a box around the entire thing and selecting all the layers and they're all I'm making sure they're all unlocked except I don't well the base map I'll make sure that's unlocked too I'm gonna do that again and uh, actually you know what for for the final map of this I, I don't want to delete it from my from my base uh, the, if I did a save as but um, but but for this I don't really need that base map anymore and it does add a lot of memory so you want to delete that but I won't for this for this at this point select everything go to object clipping mask make and you can see it just trims it right beautifully. Now I don't have any lines around my my my, my states because uh, when it where they meet water because I think that's very elegant. This would look really horsey with a big cartoony black line around it. I I don't really love what I did with the roads, but they definitely look different from the borders, which are white and the roads are dark. Um, you can you can uh, still play around with some of these colors and shapes, but basically this is pretty good. If you wanted, you can actually come up here. And uh, you can uh, come to s up to effect and do texture and maybe cha change some of the textures and granules and get a get a really cool effect on your map. So there are things you can do to play with. But this is the basic way to draw a map in Adobe Illustrator.